Yo, 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 what's up? What is out, y'all? Hold up. Before we start, we're not making jokes about the bunny. All right. Um, I didn't know it was cheetah print. I needed a bunny. Nobody helped me. I went for what I knew. I saw a bunny. I had just got my hair done. I said, fuck it. I put it on. Get out of my business. All right, next. Handgun video. A lot of people don't know about the right process and how to travel with your firearm. A lot of people don't know the paperwork you need. Can I be a felon and trap? Can I do? It's not, it's, a lot of people making it complicated. It's not really hard, honestly. It's very simple. The first time I did it, I, you know, researched, got some help from some people. So now I'm here to pass that news on to y'all. Help y'all out a little bit. Cause a lot of people still don't know to this day. Here we go. Case. This is right here. This is where I keep my gun in when I travel. Hard case. It's waterproof. The suction right here. This tightens up the suction. These two holes right here are for the locks. You have to have two locks so you can't open it. This is mandatory. You have to have this. Amazon, that's why I got this from. Can't really say how much it was. I know I didn't spend too much on it. There, there are some expensive ones with fingerprint scanners, codes. I don't really need all that. I need a basic standard. Hey, will this work? Cool. That's what we're going to go with. I might upgrade eventually, but it's not really a necessity. I don't really care about it that much. All right. Inside of it. Handgun. I have a full-size handgun, so. And magazine. When I first bought it, this was full. I had to put my gun up to it and I outlined it so I could put it in there. Same as the magazine. Now, you can still take all this stuff out. This whole thing comes out, see? You can take that whole thing out, put your gun in there how you want, you know, make it comfortable for you. However you want to do it, that's cool. Um, next, hold up. Next, this is what I travel with. All right, handgun, safety first. It's clear, Not, nothing's in there, nothing's in there. Nothing. Empty. Let's try that again. It's empty. Nothing. Empty. Magazine. Empty. Nothing. I always have to do the safety first. Now, of course, just sit this in right in here like this. Put this magazine in here like this. It's just this simple. Now, when, when I'm, as far as my ammo, when I first started flying, I used to pack my ammo separately. I used to put it, get it in a small little bag and tie it up and, you know, so they wouldn't think or assume anything. But as I started doing it more, I found out it's really not as complicated as I was making it. So I started putting my ammo inside my magazine and just putting it inside just like that. Get to the airport, they're gonna say, hey, open it up. No, when you get to the airport, first, tell them, hey, I wanna check a firearm in. They're gonna tell you to open your bag, do all this, and I have to sign a little paper that goes on the top of it. That's where this tape come from. I, my paper goes right here. Um, it's really just that simple. Detailed um, locks, just like this. Enjoy my bonnet this time. I ain't, I ain't waiting no more. Because I know y'all going to have something to say. I know how y'all like to tussle. What they be saying on Facebook? I know how y'all like, like to tussle. No. Nah, we ain't doing that. It's locked up. Of course, you can lift these. But you can't open it. It's not happening. And it's really just that simple. You pack it up. I have a hard, I have a hard shell suitcase also. So... Just a little extra care. You know, airport, they be throwing your bag all around. I kind of want my 
gun to stay in good condition. Trying some new things out. By the time this video come out, y'all will see where I went. Just going to enjoy myself. We're going to holler at y'all tomorrow and go from there. I got to get up early. What's up, YouTube? Before we get started, make sure you like, comment, subscribe to the channel. Just wanted to give a little more detailed info on what's to come when you actually get to the airport. First thing first is you locate the check bag area of the airline you're flying with. Then you want to get to the front desk and you want to tell them you're checking a firearm in. They'll ask for your ID, a form of payment. The payment is not for the firearm. It's only for the fee of the bag. And that fee depends on which airline you're flying with. It's different in a lot of cases. Bringing a firearm does not cost anything extra. They'll give you a highlighted slip that you will sign and date. The slip goes in your check bag. Sometimes they tell you to open your bag and put it in there. Sometimes they tell you to open the actual gun case for a visual check. After all that's done at the front of the desk, then you'll proceed to the area that they're going to send you to for another check with your bag. In this area, they're going to send your bag through a scanner. Sometimes they open it and, you know, do a full check or they'll just send it through the scanner it takes about five minutes and then they give you the okay if there's no further issues with your luggage once that done you, everything's fine you're good i like to get there early just because of this simple process if you're running late and you have to do this process you will miss your flight just because you don't know how busy they're gonna be and missing your flight we know how big of a hassle that is i've missed the flight before and i don't really want to go through it again after landing you'll need to locate your bag by going to customer service of the airline you flew with there has been times where my bag went to the office immediately after landing and there has been times where it comes out with everyone else's luggage it depends on where you're going and the airport you're at at that time I think everyone should take the opportunity and fly with a firearm for simple protection. There's nothing complicated about it. Don't overthink it. Everything will be good. That's just about it. Hope y'all enjoyed the video.